YouTubers and welcome back to Dale's Prime Review Channel. Today we're going to be doing a live Antutu benchmark test for the uh, Yukus UG310 uh, and our TV box and uh, and this is actually the last part of our uh, review for uh, this unit. We've uh, so far we've done an unboxing uh, review. We've done uh, uh, icons and pre-installed apps review and we've done a, a, a web browsing uh, review so make sure to check out all of those they're actually embedded inside of our uh, product description which can be found in our YouTube video description and there should be a link to the product there so here we are we're starting the test and this is uh, again is N22 4.0 it's very comprehensive and this should probably take about uh, two or three minutes so you can maybe grab a bag of popcorn or a Heineken um, let's talk a little bit more about this device. Uh, uh, luckily, uh, Yugus gave this to us weeks before anyone else would have it. And uh, we, in uh, part one, we kind of showed you the clip that it has, so it can clip on top of your uh, monitor, like up here, and it acts as a webcam. And uh, the five megapixel camera on it, it has it's on a rotatable, like uh, cylindrical uh, thing. Um, so. You can adjust the uh, camera to where you are uh, uh, to your level, and uh, so yeah. Again, it's uh, powered by a 1.4 gigahertz RK3180 3180T CPU, and basically every other uh, TV box on the market only has the 3188T, which means that it only clock up to 1.4 gigahertz. Now the main diff and uh, and that's just a fact. Now, uh, Eagles is coming out with a U, a UT2, uh, or it's also called the UG3200, uh, I think. And uh, that one has a rock chip uh, 3188 1.6 GHz CPU. Uh, this unit that we're testing right now, it uh, has a 1 GB RAM, 2 GB ROM, and uh, yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty awesome. Uh, three three full size USB ports, and uh, there's also an optional uh, wireless uh, mouse. And uh, the, the cool thing about this is that it has a a mic hole here, so you can talk into the fly mouse by pressing this button, the uh, the button here. And it just makes it you know the Skype or your video chat uh, experience that much more intimate. So we're just over a half, uh, you know, halfway th uh, through this video, and it's like uh, looks like it should be really uh, finished really soon. So I'm really uh, curious to see what type of uh, stats this gets, what type of uh, scores. And we're actually going to be running another Antutu benchmark test for the uh, Yugo's UT2. Hundred percent. And uh, let's check out the score, the ranking. For the same reason, it's not, so it gets a divide a score of uh, sixteen thousand four hundred seventy-five. So nice, nice, beautiful score for, especially for the Rock Chip thirty-one eighty-eight T. Android 4.2.2, .2, Cortex A9 CPU, Mali 400 GPU, screen resolution, screen resolution of 1280 by 672, 5 megapixel camera on the front, and uh, quad core CPU, clocking in at 1.4 GHz, 160 DPI, and uh, this was last updated on, the firmware was last updated on September 29th, so truly a new unit. So uh, this just about uh, wraps up uh, this review. Let's just check out the details. Here's the, you can pause your screen. Uh, here's the CPU integers and all that good stuff. So RAM, looks like it's 2 gigabytes RAM. Okay. So this is a 2 gigabyte RAM, 8 gigabyte ROM version. So let's uh, just double check that. Let's see if there's anything else we can check about 
this device info. Okay, so yeah, let's go under settings again and just double check. And we can do that by going under, uh, so this has Bluetooth again. And we can do this by going to running. In our last review, in our review, we weren't, so yeah, 1.5 gigabytes free and uh, and that 30, like 0.3 megabytes, a gigabytes used. So this is a two gigabyte uh, RAM version. Cool. I'm glad that we uh, that we verified that. Okay, guys. Well, uh, this is this is about to uh, conclude uh, this review. Make sure to like our video. Also, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And uh, check out our other parts. Uh, again, this this unit you can uh, find it at Deals Prime. And uh, this is actually missed the wrong picture, but it will come up. And uh, yeah. So uh, if you have any questions, you can leave them on our uh, YouTube comments page. Thanks for watching. Comments page. Thanks for watching.